A former prison inmate is free tonight because of a law passed in 2018 giving prosecutors the power to re-sentence prisoners whose time behind bars seems unjust. KPI X5's John Ramos has the story. The Contra Costa County District Attorney's Office helped release a man from prison that they themselves had put behind bars. Not because he was innocent, but because he just didn't deserve to be in prison any longer. In 2004, Derek Lewis broke into a home in Orinda stealing a purse and bicycle. Because of the three strikes law, he was sentenced to 27 years in prison. But AB 2942 authorizes prosecutors to look back at old sentences that don't reflect today's standards. We would not impose that same sentence and we would not believe that that sentence was serving the interests of um, justice. And I do think it serves us well as district attorneys to be able to have this new power to go back and to look at some old draconian sentences. During his 17 years in prison, Lewis turned his life around, kicking his addiction, taking college classes, and mentoring other inmates. So the Contra Costa District Attorney's Office, the office that put him away, has now helped him become the first convict in the county to have his sentence reduced, and he is now a free man. We knew that there were prosecutors across the state that were willing to look back at past sentences. Hillary Blount is a former San Francisco prosecutor who helped write AB 2942 and founded a group called For the People to advocate for those serving overly harsh sentences. Any prosecutor knows they've got a case they prosecuted themselves and they think about that case and think about the deal and think about the sentence um, and, and wish they could go back and do something about it. Lewis was the first in Contra Costa, but across the state, more than 60 inmates have gotten a rare chance to reclaim their lives from behind prison walls. Brandon Banks, the public defender who represented Lewis through the process, says while Lewis is deserving, he is by no means unique. We have uh, far too many people who are in state prison who have the ability to make a contribution to our community, who want to make a contribution to our community, and are just waiting for that opportunity. In Contra Costa County, John Ramos, KPIX 5.